the Austrian Chancellor and his cabinet, his entire cabinet, will host the EU Commission. In one of the big buildings behind me, this is UN City here in Vienna, and the main objective of this routine get-together at the beginning of any EU presidency is, of course, to um, fine-tune policy, to bring the EU Commission on board and to coordinate policy. Now, there's a lot on the agenda, but the overwhelming issue is, as you said, the migration crisis. And here, Sebastian Kurz will fin in, fill in uh, Jean-Claude Juncker on his latest talks he had yesterday with the German government. And, of course, the objective being to make uh, Jean-Claude Juncker happy, which is not a small feast, because there were fears within the EU Commission that Sebastian Kurz's hardline stance would eventually lead to internal border control controls, thus an undermining of the Schengen system. Yeah, as Stefan, we know about his hardline position in that other, other countries have been th thinking, OK, Austria is going to hold a rotating EU presidency. Do we know any more detail about the, the exact policy he's going to try to push forward? Well, that's exactly the problem. We don't know the details. Sebastian Kurz yesterday in a meeting to foreign, in, a, in a briefing with foreign correspondents um, remained vague. Um, his overall objective is, of course, to stop illegal immigration and to close the Mediterranean route so no more migrants across the Mediterranean Sea. The question, of course, is how do you do that? You can just not build fence in the Mediterranean. So then court says, well, we have to cooperate with Africa. We have to establish disembarkment platforms in Africa. But here the problem is, of course, that no African country, uh, country has come forward yet and said, well, we're willing to do this. So how do you implement a policy that relies deeply on a cooperation with somebody who is unwilling to do this? Here, uh, Sebastian Kurz need to step up and uh, tell us what the details are. Pat. Indeed, can't make plans uh, without the agreement of the other side. Thank you, Stefan Gorba in Vienna there.